I don't know. I don't know why, but I went with evacuation. Oh, mother. And here I figured you'd had enough of me by now. You could have undone the calamity itself, but instead you want to stay in a world like this. I gotta admit, kid, I ain't yet put much thought in that idea of carrying on with you here. We can't go back no more, but I suppose we could go wherever we please. And if anyone's left out there, I sure would like to see the look in their faces we dock this thing right on that doorstep. Getting ahead of myself, though. I'm gonna need a first mate. What do you say? Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'm going to do this in a new video as you might have seen uh, because I feel like the other video has been a little bit too long. So ladies and gentlemen, um, with that I end the playthrough of Let's Play Bastion. Um, great game, god dang. <laughs> um, I really enjoyed playing through this, it was pretty damn fun. I, I do like that they give you the decision on which endings um, you on which ending you wanna you wanna choose. That's like a great thing. Like you can save Solf or you know pretty much destroy every single one of the Yura uh, that's out there. That well that's waiting for you there. Um, I like the fact that they you know they don't allow them to shoot you. Like that's that's so great. Like you're walking there with Zolf and. One of the Euro actually tries to shoot you, and one of them is like, "Shut up," and you're dead. <laughs> that's that's a fun touch, like you know. Now, um, for those of you who want to see the other ending, I would advise you um, get the game and choose the other ending. Um, I don't know what's. Uh, I, I've already told you guys that there's apparently a function new game plus. I'm probably gonna try that out, and maybe you know. If it's the exact same game, just, you know, with some extra additions, then perhaps I can, um, I can choose the other ending and see what that is. But I'm not going to record that because you've probably seen enough of this. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the end of the Let's Play of Let's Play Bastion. Uh, as I've said, I did enjoy it. Uh, I love this guy, Rox. I'm sorry. I... You can say whatever you want. That guy's a great um, storyteller. Like, he's awesome. I, I do really like. I do really like Rux. I can't really say anything. Uh, I can't really say anything else about him. He's a great guy. Um, in the comments section down below, I'm going to just ask that. Um, tell me what you would have done. Like, would you have saved Zolf? Would you have. Would you have, well, you know, redone the Calamity with the risk that the Calamity would happen again, of course? Because that that's the thing, like, you could at that point have said, okay, we'll reverse the Calamity, but I think Rux actually at one point mentioned that, like, you don't know if it's going to work. You don't know if, if you go back to the state where the Calamity never happened, if you're actually not just going to let Celandia redo the Calamity, or maybe, you know, the Ur are, are going to do the Calamity or something, you know? You don't know that. It's actually quite possible that at that point there's not even going to be a Bastion, there's not even going to be a second choice, because in the new world, maybe, you know, Rux, the kid, Zia and Zolf would all be killed. You don't know that. Uh, and and that's kind of the thing. Like, that's what he said. Um, uh, the problem with, with a machine that, you know, redoes stuff, you don't know if it works. 
You don't know that. Like, it, pretty much, it could have just been even worse. The kid could have been dead and they would have never gotten the cores. Uh, I mean, at least I don't think so, I don't know. Maybe Rux is, is like, he just let the kid do all the work because he was lazy and actually in... He's like the strongest character of them all. He can do like crazy kung fu ninja. Why? I'm sitting here doing movements with my arms that you guys luckily cannot see. I'm really happy about that. Um, so yeah. Um, great music, dang. I do like the music. In the I, I like this game. It's like, it's not... I don't like it as much as Freedom Force, um, but that's pretty much, you know, nostalgia reasons. But it is an awesome game for, you know, it, it, it is. Like, you can't really deny that. It's a lot of fun to play um, if you like, you know, have some spare ch money or something. Uh, I would really advise you guys to pick it up. It's really fun to play. Um, I do admit that I've had to do a little bit of grinding, but that's because I wasn't playing with the shrines uh, a little earlier. If I would have played through some of the levels with a little bit with you know the shrines active or a few of the shrines active at least and you know maybe maybe it would have been a little a little easier <laughs> nick one um i'm sorry I'm, I'm not laughing my names i'm sorry um this is a 2011 game really i think it's three years old huh i thought i thought i was younger for some weird reason ah and the city crest to end the credits I guess. So, look for New Game Plus in the story menu. Begin the journey with all of your weapons and XP. Ooh, that's cool. New shrine idols and distillery spirits added. All bastion structures buildable in any order. Use the shrine for the toughest challenge. So that's uh, what New Game Plus is apparently. So I get to use all my weapons from the beginning. That's pretty cool. So yeah, story, new game plus, I can now do this, which is pretty cool. But I'm not going to record that because it's probably going to be the exact same story, just with the weapons that I already had. So yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, with that I'm going to leave the episode off here. I'm going to leave this Let's Play off here. Um, I do have plans for another weekly uh, Let's Play. Uh, but it's going to be kind of the same as the one uh, that I'm preparing. Uh, I'm, I'm going to prepare them a little bit first before I do upload them, which could take some time. Um, so, yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, with that, I'm going to end it off. I hope you did enjoy this Let's Play. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys around. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been 7 Rasta 6. Until next time.